Hey guys, how's it going? This is Natnado. And we're back with Corpse Party. Now, I have no idea what the hell I was trying to do last time, but... I think that we're just gonna carry on. There wasn't anything that way. I believe that we just have to, um... Start playing with these guys now. Let's see. Ah, we just came out of there, right? Hmm. Maybe I should check these. Completely empty on all of them. Interesting. I don't remember toilets like this. All doors are affixed to the wall. Interesting. Oh wait, I do remember toilets like this. The area's just changed a little. Huh. I can't progress. Alright. Well, that means that I guess I go to play as the other people then. Excellent. Hmm. So, a lot of this playthrough is dedicated to finding boards. I haven't seen any boards lately. Have I checked this? Apparently so. Hmm. I remember that. Closet trespassers will be expelled. Ah, it's got something to do with that closet on um, in the room along this way. Just gotta figure out how to move it. Maybe. I don't know. Sometimes I think I'm doing the right thing and I'm just doing the wrong thing. Yep. I need to get in there. But how? How will I get in there? Is this the thing... No, it's not. Not where we left the messages. Hmm. I'm kind of lost as to what I'm supposed to be doing. What is this? Some loose pages from Naho's notebook lie haphazardly spread on the ground. Naho's notes, two out of five. I had a final exam today, so I went to school for the first time in quite a while. It seems while I was gone, Kubi... God, Kabiki came here to Heavenly Host without me. It's too dangerous. We don't have enough data, he said, trying to justify why he'd skulk into his sacred ground behind my back. His assistant, Taguchi, most likely put him up to it. I did give him all the details on how to return home from here, and it's a fairly simple process, but I can't help worrying about him nonetheless. At any rate, the blog's been updated, and I do feel bad about dragging my friend Sayaka into this. But it's time to dive headfirst into these trenches, and really feel out what this place is all about. What's this? Blood? Naho. What could have happened to her before she died here? I don't know. But it's cool. Kind of. More boards. Still nothing this way. God damn it. Seriously. I really don't know what I'm doing. If I click this, they're still here, so that doesn't help me. Alright. I guess I just have to keep exploring then. Yep, and that's what I'll do. Alright, so. As we're walking around, how's everyone been? Oh, more notes. You'll have to uh, hold off on telling me how you are. Naho's notes, 3 out of 5. Herein, I will detail the proper observance of Sachiko Shinazaki's charm, as well as a means of reversing its effects and returning home. Payda. No. It can't be. What you you didn't even read it out. God damn it. Okay. I think this is where we found the first note, so I doubt that it'll be in here. No, it's not. Okay. Let's keep looking for the notes. I think that's what um our task is right now. Let's try this way. Anything? Nope. 
trespassers will be expelled. Think about your futures. Uh, Sitigaba is watching you. All of Japan is watching you. Down with the trespassing. Mmm. Someone's, uh, pretty hard about trespassing. Interesting. Any notes? No. Those are notes that have always been there. Maybe another one's appeared around here. No. Mm, maybe one of the notes is on the other people's side now. Who knows? Just make sure. They haven't got much to explore. Maybe down on the stairwell? Nope. And if there's a note in one of the bathrooms, I doubt it, but I just want to double check to make sure. I like to cover all my bases, as I'm sure I've said before. Oh, what the hell? Sorry, I just got a little, um, error on my screen. Okay, sorry about that. You probably didn't notice that, uh, anything happened just now, but, uh, I got a weird error, so... Just making sure that it doesn't mess up the recording. Anyway, carrying on. Carrying right along. Uh, so we're up to three out of five. There's two more. Where could they appear? I think one might appear in that classroom, maybe. If luck's on my side. No? Maybe? Can I go down this way? Yes. Note. Nope. No notes. Looks like luck isn't on my side, damn it. Hmm, where else? Ah, oh, come on. Give me a note, please. I'm so... So very, very lost with what I need to do. Apparently this team was looking for the girl in the red dress, and the other team was looking for the way out. They already found the way out, but they're fucking trapped now, so... This group's gotta do something. This team... What is it? Ayumi and Yoshiki. They need to figure some shit out. But right now, all they're doing is walking around in circles, being completely useless. Excellent. Ah! Yes, I know. I know. What can I do about this, though? I can't do anything about this. Damn it. What am I gonna do? There's nothing this way. Maybe I do have to be with the other people. I wish I could just, like, get you guys to tell me what to do, because I'm sure you're, like, screaming at the screen right now, like, you missed something, or I know what to do. And I'm just like, I got no idea. I am completely stumped at this point. Have notes appeared inside these closets? No. Darn it. Maybe these guys go back down the ladder. I was thinking about that. Oh, they do! Oh, they do! You're an idiot, Nathan. Ah, uh, I think I've already read this stuff. Oh my god, I clicked it twice. I'm an idiot. Come on, alright. God damn it. I've been walking around all this time, wondering what I was doing, and the whole time, I could have just walked out. I'm a genius. Skeletal remains, done deal. Alright, maybe now we can find the other notes. Awesome! I feel like we're progressing now. Haha. <laughs> oh my. Would you look at that? It's one of these things. Oh my god, you see that? That's progression right there. Oh shit, is this normal? Remains of a female student, disgusting. God damn it. Oh, there's another one over there. Even if you're feeling trapped, remember, tomorrow is forged by yesterday and today, and all can flow in perfect harmony. Expel all closet trespassers. Seriously, that shit cray. They need to get a calm... Calmness. I, I don't know what the fuck I'm saying there. What the hell is this? 
empty pedestal against the wall here with a peculiarly shaped round slot at the top. Okay, cool. There's a save point there, but I don't think we need it just yet. Let's check out... Actually, fuck it, we're gonna go... I am in Yoshiki, let's have a sh... Oh, let's save here. Fuck it. I know, I'm changing my mind all the time. Don't be mad at me. Alright. We're rolling on, guys. Freaking progress. I like that. Whenever something good happens, it's because of progress. And I really hope I'm going the right way. Because I'm going to be pretty embarrassed if I'm walking the wrong way. No worries, though. Because I believe that this is progress right up here. It better be. Yes, that's it right there. Hell yeah. Fuck. Whoa, blood in there. Take that. A lone student ID name tag lying on the floor. Oh, it's you, you're kissing me. Cool. Alright, I'm just gonna save again. To save the walk. Because I got a feeling I'm gonna die when I go in there. You know how it is, blood. Ah. Well, I don't care. I I was being safe anyway. What the hell is this? Hello? I get up your bum. Corpse is extremely so Oh, come on. I had to make that joke. And it's a young child, of course. Alright, anyway, notes. Strange but true. Stories of the occult. Chasing down the hidden past of the cursed school building. Part 4. By Ku Kabiki. I shouldn't be alone. I shouldn't be alone. We're not the first to come here, it seems. There have been many before us. And every one of them has either died or been swallowed up by the school itself. I swear I've read this before. I'm not simply using the word, sw the word swallowed for dramatic effect either. It is, regrettably, an apt description. There's a massive curse... Ah, oh, fuck, I just skipped it. I'm an idiot. Oh well. I'm sure you guys can pause and go back if you want it. It chips away at a person's core. Sanity, reason, even identity, eventually destroying him. Nothing that made him who he is is left behind. Once it's gripped your heart, you'll quickly succumb to despair and loneliness. The essence of what makes you human is literally eaten away, as if by worms. When this happens, the body begins to necrotize, and the soul becomes as black as spent ash. We've come to regard this process as darkening, and whosoever succumbs to the darkening becomes an inseparable part of the school itself. In rare instances, one may be able to avoid the full act of darkening, instead fated to be seared unbearably by intense, violent thoughts and emotions. But most of the time his soul will be rooted here, and he will be cursed to wander these halls for eternity, with no hope of passing or exorcism. Thus my use of the word swallowed. The school swallows us whole, growing fatter with tortured souls every day. It makes me shudder just thinking about it. The means by which I've come here, the Sachiko charm. If its particulars ever got out into the mainstream, the school would never go hungry again. To any who may be reading this fourth installment, and soon the fifth, it's clear that you're a victim trapped within this hellish place, just as I am. The least I can do is give you some advice to help keep you alive as long as possible. If you still have even the dimmest shred of hope, hang on to it. Keep it firmly in your heart. Never give up on it. I can't stress that enough. I hope you'll be looking forward to part five. My assistant Taguchi has disappeared somewhere. Now that I'm by myself, I can no longer go home. So I'm just going to keep writing. It's my one true calling, after all. No matter what happens, as long as there's life left in me, as long as my hands can still move, I will never stop writing. 
Well, fucking good on you, man. What the fuck is this? Are we gonna die here? Oh, okay. I guess that means that uh, we'll have to come back here later. Let's try upstairs and then we'll... Uh, uh, do something else, I don't know. Shit. Alright, where the hell are we now? Today's Spirit Breaker, uh, Crush Middle, was divided into two souls. One painted red and one painted green. Closet trespassers will be expelled. Wow. There it is again. Oh my, what the hell? I've never seen this place before. The wisdom of heart care counselors and the genealogy of scholarly studies. Okay. This must be the library then. A pretty small one. All things considered, these books are in remarkably good condition. Well, good. I like to hear that. I like that. Alright. Oh! Empty. 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 That's cool. This is where the other blokes are. Or maybe not. They're not there. I was wrong. Okay. Where the hell am I going? <laughs> I don't even know. Did I come this way? Yeah, I did. Okay. <clears throat> Let's try um, exploring more. Or did I explore it all already? I think I have explored it all already. Yeah, I did. Alright. That's good to know. Good to know that I explored it all already. Alright. Now, what is this, this all about? The marble statue seems like it would fit perfectly. Set it in place. Um... Okay. Whoa! Cool. Alright, so I don't have a second one, though. I guess we'll have to find the second one. <clears throat> and pass it along. Was there nothing else I could do out here? Just gonna double check. Double checking. Double checking's okay. No worries. It's all good. Could I go this way? Oh, I could go this way. Interesting. I wonder whether it's important that I go this way or not, though. Meh. Who cares? We'll go this way anyway. The darkening has already begun. Oh gosh, now we know what that means. Why not? Alright, awesome. Alright, I remember all this. Yep. Ah, I'm gonna be pretty unhappy if this is just a waste of time. Just saying. Maybe I'll have to edit this out if uh, this is a waste of time. Better not be. Yep. It's um, starting to look like it is. It's starting to look like it's going to be a big waste of time. Hello? Anybody? Note? Believe the girl. Okay, which girl? Heavenly Host. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we've read this like a million times now. Yep, we have. <clears throat> Damn it, this really was a waste of time. Darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it. Alright. Alright, we're not gonna dig any further, we're just gonna go back now. Save the trouble. But then again, I swear the other side couldn't do anything anyway. Did Ayumi and Yoshiki really have anything else to do? I don't think they did. But then again, I've got no more keys, so... Maybe I'll have to come back here at a later time. Hmm. Oh well. We'll sort something out. <clears throat> Alright, we'll head back over for now. 
We have not lost all hope just yet. That's not the way we want to go. This is the way we want to go. All right, let's let's transfer back over here for a minute. Was there anything in here? No, but there must be. They wouldn't give us this place for there to be nothing in it. Well, maybe they did. Who knows? Wait, what? <clears throat> Wide variety of books on this shelf. Everything from technical manuals to science theses, theses to scrapbooks full of newspaper clippings. Okay. Wisdom, okay. So why does why is that book there in particular? Oh well. Maybe it's nothing. Maybe it's everything. Who knows? All I know is that there's something about that closet. And we need to trespass in there. Can this door be opened? It's locked. Maybe we need a key for it. I've already gone down here. May as well go down a second time just to make sure. Ah, that's right. That's the place we come back to later. I'm very confused about everything right now. I just don't know what I'm doing. I'm just walking around like a headless chicken. And it's... It's just... I don't know what's going on. I just don't know what to do. There doesn't seem to be any way to progress anymore. If only I could find something that would help the progression. Okay. I've got an idea. I'm gonna stop walking around. Well, I'm gonna keep walking around. But, I'll uh, catch you guys up when I find something worth looking at. So, I'll, I'll see you then then. Be right back then. Time to do some exploring. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay, it's only been like two seconds since I paused it, but I have an idea. It may not be a good idea, but it's an idea nonetheless. So we're gonna try it out right now. So, the last thing I remember doing, like, since I had the big break and whatnot, Naomi was, um, complaining that she lost her thing, right? She lost her student ID, and Ayumi has it, because she picked it up earlier. So, if I go to the meeting points, you know, the part where, you know, there's just a little gap over here, maybe, just maybe, they'll be able to communicate with each other, and they'll be like, hey, look, Freaking! Oh wait, it's this way. Uh, I got you, fucking stupid thingy, majingy, and then I don't know how that'll help progression, but you know, it'll be something to look at. Which is what I said. I will come back when there's something to look at, and that's what we're doing. All right, let's do this shit. Hopefully, this works. All right. Hey guys! Yes! Yes! Oh my god! You serious? Well, there was no body, but Morishigi, Morishigi was beyond saving at that point, I think. But why? I wish everyone would stop dying so easily. <laughs> Class rep. Guess the only one left is Miss Yui, then. God, how can you be so matter-of-fact about it? Uh, uh, um, sorry? I think it goes without saying that none of our friends who died here would want us to join them. We all want to get out of here. So let's just cling to that desire and keep me, uh, keep moving forward. 
We know the way out. So even with things a little bleaker now, there's still that hope for us. We're almost there. All we have to do is find Miss Yui, and then we can finally escape this living hell. Sounds good. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I almost forgot. Nakashima, I have something of yours. Ah, my student ID. Sorry, I didn't get the ID back to you sooner. You must have been freaking out about it, if you knew the way out. Believe me, I was. Well, then don't go losing that scrap again, okay? Thank you so much. You have no idea what a relief it is to have this back. Shinazaki. Nice job finding that. I can't even tell you how much of a load off our minds it is. No problem at all. Okay, let's give it our best shot. We're almost there, right? Oh, something's happening. Thank God. I was about to say... Oh. Nothing happened. Great. Well... I can't say it was absolutely nothing, though. Let's just see. Maybe... Maybe something happened over here, who knows. Because I was kind of thinking, oh my god, yes! I was fucking right. Oh my god, yes! This is progression right here. What the hell is that? Is that on our side? Or is that on their side? I can't remember anything. All I know is that... God damn. That is lucky. <clears throat> Could have been walking around for ages trying to figure that one out. Alright. If I can't find it on this side, then it must be on the other side. Look at you, walking like a fucking man. Do, 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 do. We're fucking figuring things out, and it's making me feel good. Alright. Now where is the... Where is the location? Is that on this side, or was it on the other side? Can't quite remember. Alright, it wasn't out here. In that case, I'll just swap over wait for the other team to find it. I'm cool with that. Got no complaints. It's progress. When those... When those uh, bridges are formed, it makes me feel a little bit more happy inside. I don't know why. It's probably not down here. I think it's definitely not down here. I'm an idiot. It was down here. Okay. Hello. Body of a senior high school student. Awesome. Stop. Why? What's wrong? There's something here. Huh? Hey. Is there really something down this hall? There definitely is. Be very, very careful. Okay. Baby steps. Mm. They just... They did a thing. They said... They said that there was something here. I want to save now. Fuck it, we're going in. Charge in. Oh shit, question marks. Hello? Who? Anybody home? No, nope, nobody's in. Oh shit, there's something over there. Oh shit, that doesn't look too good. I kind of really want to save right now. Uh, Alright, I'll see you guys back here. I'll go and save. Okay, the save hath been completeth. Aren't you glad you didn't have to watch me walk back? Oh shit. Alright, let's do this shit something wrong? This room seems to be set up for black magic or witchcraft or something. How do you figure? I don't see anything out of the ordinary. Come on, we should keep moving. 
You said there was a presence out by the incinerator, right? What? Am I talking from Ayumi's point of view, or Yoshiki's? I guess it's hers. Mm, let's say... Let's go. Actually, how about you go on ahead, and I'll catch up with you. That's not what I said, is it? I don't know. Uh, okay, but don't take too long. Huh? What was that voice just now? I didn't say any of that. Shinazaki! Hey! Shinazaki! What? What is it? No. God, no! Kishinuma! Kishinuma! Am I trapped in here? Open up! Come on! Kishinuma! Somebody open the damn door! Come on, please! Oh. Shinazaki. Am I ever glad to see you, and alive no less. Are you alright? Now I'm hearing Miss Yui's voice. If this turns out to be a fake too, I'm really gonna lose it. What are you talking about? Come on over here. There's nothing to be afraid of anymore. It really is you. Where have you been all this time? We've been worried sick. I'm so sorry. It must have been terrifying in here but all by yourself. Oh, God. Miss Yui, you're injured. Pretty severely, too, but from the looks of it. Shinaza- Ah! Oh, my arm is in bad shape. Shinazaki. Come on, stand up. I fucking skipped it, I'm sorry. Ah, ng. Oh, what the hell? Eek. Quickly, grab hold of my leg. Climb up my body. Miss Yui, no! Quickly! Ng. I can't support both our weights with one arm for much longer. My fingers are... Hurry, Shinazaki, you'll fall in too. I... I, I know... My fingers... I can't... Hold on... Ah! Ah, Miss Huey, Miss Huey! Come on, you're almost there! Uh, <laughs> Rah! <laughs> Shinazaki! Pull her up! Do it! Miss Huey! Grab her hand! No, don't! I'll climb up on my own! The floor could collapse at any moment. You two need to get out of here. But... Do it! And Kishinuma, take care of Shinazaki. Miss Yui. Urgh. Shinazaki, come on. Shinazaki. Shinazaki, be strong. No matter what happens, be strong. You have abilities that can outmatch anyone else's. And once you get out of here, I know everything's going to work out just fine. You know, with that dream of yours we were talking about. <gasps> now get the hell out of here! Don't you understand the gravity of the situation? Go! Now! <gasps> Shinazaki. Oh god. No. No! <laughs> Miss Yui. Miss Yui! Shinazaki, come on, we have to move. Let go of me, I don't care anymore. Shinazaki. Listen, you may be willing to let Miss Yui's sacrifice go to waste, but I'm not. Kishinuma. This is what she meant when she said, be strong, damn it! <laughs> what the... F Who? It's the principal. The fuck is going on? 
What a strange looking incinerator. Almost seems like something you'd see in a, in a crematorium. What's that? Looks like somebody threw something in there that's very yellow. You can see a yellow ribbon a few feet in, covered in soot. I think it's the ribbon from from Sachiko's dress, but it's just out of reach. Mm. Arms not quite long enough. What was that? From the darkness within the incinerator, the figure of a girl can faintly be seen. She's squatting with hands around her knees. W whoa It's... It's Chico. Upon meeting your gaze, she spins in place and begins crawling deeper into the machine until she vanishes from sight. What the hell? It's pretty cramped in there, but it looks like maybe, with a little effort, you could crawl down pretty far through this thing. Actually, look over there. There's a tiny pinprick of light. It might be a room or something. Good a lead as any. Wait, are you nuts? This is an incinerator. What if somebody lights it up while we're inside? Good point. Okay, you wait here, and I'll go by myself. Uh, you. Okay, fine, I'll go too. I don't like where this is going. I told you to wait at the top. No way, I'm coming with you. Damn it. Well, be careful in here, okay? There are some pretty thick clumps of dust and ash that you'll get yourself caught on if you don't watch out. Thanks. Damn, it's a tight squeeze in here. We've come pretty far, but it seems like we're still only about halfway. Maybe it's because the ceiling's so low that we can't even come close to standing up. But I've honestly never felt this uneasy before in my life. If the exits all get blocked, I could wind up stuck in this position forever. Ah, what the hell is wrong with me? I shouldn't think about things like that. <coughs> Man, my elbows are sore as hell. <coughs> Never seen so much dust and ash before. We can't keep breathing this in. <coughs> Ow! Hey, you alright? Just pricked my hand a little. There's some kind of metal wire in here. Good to know. Turn back. M Please, turn back. <gasps> okay. Now, I'm... I kind of want to turn back, because if we recall when I was as, um, playing as... Uh, Mochida, when I went into the other building, there was a note, and it said, Listen to the girl, I believe. But, just for the sake of, you know, in case this actually kills me, I kind of want to see how it happens. And if it doesn't, then, you know, keep going. Let's do it. I saved already. Well, that clinches it. There's definitely something in here. Come on. Uh, okay. Turn back. Stay away. Didn't I tell you to turn back? <laughs> what? Oh, you're fucking kidding me. They died. They died. I... And I can still play with them dead, apparently. You know what? Um, I don't like that. I'm going to go and get them back now. So, 
One minute. You know what? Um, now that we're here, I'm going to try the other option, see what happens, just for the sake of it. Go on. Actually, how about you go on ahead and I'll catch up with you? Uh, okay, but don't take too long. Huh? What was that voice just now? Oh, uh, okay. Alright, so, it happens either way. Alright then, well, I guess we'll uh, catch you back up at the incinerator part. Alright, here we are. Turning back. Hey, can we just go back? I have a really bad feeling about this. Uh, yeah, okay. You able to turn around? Just take your time. Uh-huh. Yay! Woohoo! They're still alive. I don't know, though. I really feel like there's something fishy going on down there. And I don't think there's anywhere else we can go. I don't like it, but... If you're that set on going through with it, I'll go too. Oh, what the fuck? They've just gone right back in! Yeah, there's definitely something in here. Come on. Okay. Turn back. Stay away. Ah. Oh. Didn't I tell you to turn back? Ha 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 ha. So they're dead now. That's brilliant. Ah, uh, I kind of figured that that may have been the case, because I mean, you know, like, they wouldn't let you keep playing the game without, you know, two of the main characters. Damn it! Alright, so Yoshiki and fucking Ayumi are now fucking out of the picture. Wonderful. What the hell am I supposed to do now? There's no other way for me to progress anywhere. There's the other side of the school, but I don't know what that's all about. What else can I do? There's nothing up here. Let's see if the fucking TV works now. Nope. Make sure there's nothing going on up here then. Oops. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. I just went into the toilet. Okay. You don't think that these guys think it's strange that, um, the fucking pentagrams have vanished? Well, they weren't even pentagrams, they were stars. Either way. Ah, uh, god damn it. Why do they have to die for? That sucks. Well, I guess. Oh, we just have to suck it up and carry on then. Man, that's pretty heavy. They've pretty much killed everyone now. There's no one left except for these two. Right? Who else is there? No, everyone who came is now dead. The only people who are left are Mochida, Yuka, and Naomi. Which is pretty shit, if you ask me. Hmm. I don't even want to save. Maybe I will. Maybe I made a mistake somewhere down the line. And from the looks of it, the only place I can go is the other side of the building. Like, it doesn't look like there's anything else I can do in that side of the school. Oh, wait. Cool. Oh, what the fuck? Ah, yeah, eek. W what the hell did we just see? He leaped from the roof of the building. So I'm guessing that was the principle of Heavenly Host. Huh? What the fuck? Oh, God! Yuka, don't look. <laughs> Is it just... Yeah. I doubt he can ever find rest after what he did. So he's just reliving his death over and over again. That's horrible. 
Wait, what's that? Looks like a key. Yeah, but a key to what? I'm gonna go get it. Don't, it's too dangerous! I'll be alright. I'll wait for my chance, then I'll rush in and take it. Ugh. Got it! What the... Man, it's a lot smaller than it looked from back there. Is it to a desk or something? Principal's key. Hmm, interesting. Okay, you got it. Now come back over here, Satoshi. Alright, well, I've got a feeling I know what it's for. And, there's a save, so I'm gonna do it. And with that little save, I'll put it on a new one, just in case. I don't want to mess everything up. And with that save, I think I'm going to end the video. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode, and are still enjoying the playthrough. It's a really fun game, I'm loving it. I feel like I'm getting close to some sort of end. I mean, you know, everyone's dead now, so... Let's hope that we can do something about it. I'll see you guys uh, next time. I should probably figure out some kind of outro to say for these things, but for now, I'll see you guys later. Bye.